and the cloth isn't free. It comes at the cost of reality remaining discreetly problematic. I pay in smiles covered with honey. Honey, I'm tired of these highs. These white teeth politely asking you to please pass the salt, so I reach across the table and tell my aunt to fuck off. After the guest left, she got somber. She says, Annie, dear, there's a way to remain graceful while requesting a little flavor for your meal. What she means is, Annie, you feel too real. What she means is we've been eating at this table for 86 years and you ain't finna fuck up my game. What she means is we eat at a table that wasn't invited to sit. Wait, what she means is that mad, broke, poor people ain't shit unless they sit right. I left. I told her this. I left. I told her this home is as bones without beating, but don't feed bullshit to a white nest beating. If she was home, she'd be eating at a cherry table positioned under a tree. She'd be using silver spoons to slowly poke perspective into a stove. But I'm busy here reading the new Jim Crow, and I don't believe shit she told me. My skin is white, and my heart is dark, as a place which sees light through two pinholes like you who forgive you. I will continue to make honey read and retain information. Give a nation this day, but not the bread. I'll still spread and pay for some pussy with sex. Pause. <laughs> when a cop stops a black man six times on Bell Isle while he's trying to bike, your privilege is pretty, white girl, but it isn't live. It's sweet, and I told you, I don't eat. Watch me sting six times. I want that life in his shoes and mine. I want that one time for the one time a cop stopped me. He asked me why. White people don't commit crimes. Mm. He asked me why. Because the war on drugs is a translated form of a historic subordination of a racial minority. He asks mm. me why. I said they make bones by you being in prison. Listen. Mm. There's some weed in my bike. Fuck what my life is like. It isn't free. They try to sell me coffee. I'll probably dunk it in some black tea. D up with my loose knees and stop drinking pot for me. Come hit this. I'm in it. These bones are as home as breathing, but don't feed bullshit to a white bitch beating. Mm. Hmm. <laughs> Just score up. Are we ready, Jordan? Okay. I see 8.2, 8.5, 8.9, 9 9.0, and 9.3. Give it up for the poet. Contestants, don't touch the mic. That's what happens, sis. You just hit the button. It's okay. All right. Next. Next. E, I'm sorry, just to, be, just to be clear. What is her full name? Annie R. 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 U. O. K. I'm done. Go ahead. <laughs> Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? <laughs> Moving along, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Tichelle George. When you tell stigma. If stigma were an acronym, it would stand for shaming the innate greatness of my authenticity. Mm. Mm. Stigma. Like a stain. Out, damn spot, out. Not enough oxy, not enough shout to erase the pain, to diminish the doubt, to 
recapture the innocence that your ignorance stamped out to feel no shame when I talk about the voices that she hears but I never did see and his high energy and eccentricity, the failed interventions and constant abuse, the way I sometimes feel like there's just no use in crying or trying, too exhausted to care, but yet still too afraid to take the ultimate dare. When in fact all we need is affordable health care for our nation to give a damn, to get some help even with no money in my hands, to not feel ashamed for needing to talk or for taking those pills that quiet my thoughts. But it doesn't mean that I'm not still me. You call it a curse, but could it be that this is his special gift made just for me to have superhuman powers and to see what the naked eye cannot even perceive, but we never celebrate those who struggle day to day, those who seem stuck and impossible to motivate, because it is you, Stigma, who stands in our way, blocking the path to have anyone say that sometimes a bad day is way more than just that, and sometimes it feels like you're under attack, and were it not for the stigma, more would reveal their truth then. Sexual abuse would not be the only cry of the Me Too, and maybe then there would be a revolution for mental health care, and maybe then stigma would lose the battle as hearts and minds grow more aware, and maybe then true healing would replace our fears as we embrace our gifts and cast off despair. Nice. DJ's on point, man. Always. Oh, DJ's on point. <laughs> Judges? Uh, Hold them up. I have 7.5, 8.2, 8.5, 7.5, 8.2, 8.5, 9.5, 9.5. Twenty-five seconds. We got, we got a problem with these batteries, homie. <laughs> we got a problem with these batteries, man. You want me to hook up one mic? Is that the one? Is that the one we can play? Testing one, two, three. Hey. Yeah. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for M. A. A medicinal lab. I am poetry that'll get up in your mind, body, soul. I am Janet Jackson control. I am reckless abandon, flowing fluidly. A prisoner being fed water and the autobiography of Malcolm X. I am oh, muted breath. 
from Underground Railroad passengers silently singing. Dogs out. I am, I am, I am, I am a poetic panhandler. Can anybody spare a nickel? Quarter penny dime, I am poetry seeking change. I am poetry changing his name to spoken word because of an outstanding warrant. Arrested development, living just enough for the city. Pigeonholed, a dove's cry, trapped in a bar, so don't drop me. I am the quicker picker up of the coming to America dream of immigrants of Zamunda. I am Dr. Martin Luther Prince. Purple clad, the color of struggle today. I'm on my Nipsey hustle. Yeah. Tomorrow, tomorrow it's easy like Sunday. Then digital underground on Wednesday, doing the Humpty Hump day. I am the chance to do your dance, boogie woogie to the rhythm. They say is how dare you say different? If I ain't poetry, a woogie ain't hairy. If I ain't poetry, a Catholic's favorite football play ain't the hell Mary. I married poetry and became one flesh till death do us. Life is a poet's gift. If the dinosaurs had poetry, they would still exist. Ooh. I am existential. I am concrete. A rose grew from me. Mm. I am poetry. Yeah. Just press the button over. This should be open. Press the button. Is it green? One, 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 one. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay. Yes, sir. Judges, we're ready, I see. Yeah, y'all, y'all. I have 8.8, .8, 9, 8, 9. 9. 4, 9.4, 9.5, 9.7, and 9.8. Yeah. 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 28.6. Give it up for Matt. Yeah. 